Jennifer Lawrence is willing to risk her career for this cause, plus she wants to start a Time's Up hotline, reveals her experience with sexual harassment, and spills details on her Me Too docuseries with Kat Sadler. Jennifer Lawrence may be taking a break from acting for a year, but she's still putting in work. Jennifer has been on her promo tour for her upcoming film Red Sparrow, and while making a stop at women's workspace The Wing, she spilled the details on a few projects she's going to be giving some time to while she takes some time away from acting. And they all have to do with combating sexual harassment in the workplace as well as fighting for equal pay for women. One thing J-Law mentioned she'd love to do is create a Time's Up hotline so that less established and lesser known actresses could have a support system to share their experiences of harassment or assault. Jennifer said of the idea, quote, one of the conversations we had was, how do I use this power that I have now? Nobody f with me now, but they did. How do I use that to help people that are not as big in the world as me? So that's when the idea of a hotline, that wasn't my idea, came up. Jennifer went on to explain that the hotline would connect these women with ones involved in the Time's Up movement, such as Reese Witherspoon, Brie Larson, and herself. As Jen pointed out, these powerful women know the heads of every studio in Hollywood, and they could call them up and ask about the reported harassment or abuse directly. While the brilliant idea would be a direct way for abusers to be outed, it could possibly have negative repercussions for Jen as she could end up on a no cast list with certain directors and producers, but clearly that's a risk Jen is willing to take to help other women. As for her own history of sexual harassment, Jen said that while she wasn't one of Harvey Weinstein's victims, she has been harassed. She explained, quote, I was certainly mistreated. I was definitely treated in a way that I think now we would call abusive. I mean, I had to deal with being young and having executives or higher ups putting their hands on my legs and not feeling like I could say, please don't do that. She mentioned one specific incident in which one male executive told her, quote, he didn't know why everyone thought I was so fat, he thought I was perfectly f***able. Wow, that's actually completely unacceptable. But thankfully, Jen is working on another project. She's working on a docuseries with former e-host Kat Sattler. Jen spilled that she's executive producing a show with Kat that is inspired by the Time's Up and Me Too movements, focusing on the quote, issues facing women today, specifically the gender wage gap. Jen and Kat have both been vocal about their frustrations of not being paid as much as their male colleagues, with Jen pinning an essay on her experience with negotiating her salary for American Hustle, and Kat sharing a post about leaving E! because she wasn't even offered half as much as her male counterpart at the network. Well, it's safe to say that that docuseries will have a lot of people talking, so let me hear your thoughts on that, and do you think the hotline is a good idea? Sound off in the comment section below, and after that, click right over here to check out the newest episode of Get Jack. Thanks so much for watching, and make sure you subscribe for more Clever. I'm your host, Emil Ennis Jr. You can find me at Emil Ennis Jr., and I'll see you next time.